Hi students, today we are going to see the 5th standard, term 2 and unit 2, the name of the lesson is the strength in its weakness. Okay, now we can go for the book back exercises. Let us understand, okay, A, choose the correct option. His father wanted him to do well in a. Cricket. B. Studies. 3. C. Kabaddi. Studies is the answer for it. Okay. B. Agilan's passion is to learn Karata, Judo, Kalari. B. Judo is the answer for it. Third one. Master trained Agilan on a single stroke. Okay. C. Single stroke is the answer for it. Fourth one. Agilan's learned Judo for two years. Okay. A. Three years. B. Two years. C one year, the answer is two years. B name the character or speaker. Believe yourself, Agilan Judo Master. Second one, learn well, live well. Agilan's father. Third one, how did I win the competition with a single stroke? Agilan, the speaker is the Agilan or character is Agilan. Fourth one, my dear, you learned the most difficult stroke in judo. Judo master is the speaker there. Okay. Now we are going for C. Uh, answer the following question. Who was Agilan's inspiration? The answer is in the page number 98. His physical education teacher was his inspiration. What is the answer? His physical education teacher was his inspiration. Second question. What did he lose his hands? Sorry. How did he lose his hand? Second answer is Agilan lost his hand in an accident. Third question, what was his master's advice? Third one, his master advised to believe himself. Fourth question, why did everyone ridicule the boy? Everyone ridiculed Agilan and his master as they were not sure how a boy with one hand could win a national competition. Once again I'll read for you. Everyone ridiculed Agilan and his master as they were not sure how a boy with one hand could win a national competition. Fifth question. How did he win the match? The answer. He attacked his opponent with four single strokes and four knockouts. Once again, I'll read for you, students. He attacked his opponent with four single strokes and four knockouts. Next page number one, not two. Okay. Let us build. It is a big tree. No, it is a huge tree. You both are correct. As, as the father said, the words big and huge have similar meaning. They are There are many words that have the same meaning. Let us see. So angry, what is the, the same meaning for us? Furious, happy, joy, cut, chop, slim, thin. So read the sentences and write the words with the same meaning, same meaning for the unlined words. So they are given small, sick, large, glad, stone, Leap they are given. Okay. Now we can say I ate a big apple. So large is the answer for it. This is a little dog. Small. Similar meaning. I threw a rock in the lake. Stone. Okay. I am happy. Glad. Now page number 103. Circle the difference between the following pictures. So that is a different. I just see. What are the different uh, the sun is here smiling here. The sun is not smiling in the picture. The tree looks very big and that is very long. And there are ducks in this picture. There are no ducks in the picture. Okay. So the sun is happy. The picture sun is sad. The tree is tall. The tree is short. The pond is full of water. The pond is empty. And the word that denotes is you can, you can read it and I'll go for the exercises. Is this bottle empty? No, it is full. Is this, is this a small tree? No, it is huge. Is he standing on the top? No, he is at the bottom. Is this a dark room? No, it is bright. 
ஸ்டாடியவல் ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ் தேங்க்யூ